Today I'm going to share with you five grocery saving apps that is going to save you tons of money on your groceries every single month. Hi, I'm Amanda Vandergulik from Cleverdo.com and I help you save money and earn money doing the things that you love to do. If that sounds like something you're interested in, then make sure you click subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified as soon as my next video comes out to help you. Today, I'm going to share with you the five grocery money saving apps that I use to save my family hundreds of dollars of grocery money every single month and I'm so excited to share this with you so let's dive in oh and stick around because at the end of this video I'm gonna give you access to a PDF I put together just for you that lists all of the grocery saving apps that I have and that I use and so that you can go and check them out but we're gonna walk through them today so let's get started Okay, this is really exciting to me because, and I apologize in advance, it might look a little confusing. I promise that I will make a video specifically for this app in the future for you. It is called Swagbucks. And it has been incredible for earning extra cash. And again, it's a regular, like, um, it's the kind of app where you can do a whole bunch of things. You can take surveys, watch videos. Um, you can earn cash back just by what, uh, just by browsing your internet through their search function, which I do every single day. You can take quizzes, but today I want to focus only on the grocery store app, the way to save money on your groceries with this. Okay, so what you can do is you go into the shop area and you can earn online so let's say we wanted to go to walmart i'll just choose walmart because i know that they offer groceries as well and you can look and see if your local store is in here as well because they keep adding them all the time so this is how it works so you can see here with walmart you could earn one percent cash back by going through swag bucks to get to Walmart, you can see how it's, it's uploading the page for me and it will redirect in a second. Here we go. Now I am in Walmart, but I'm still in the Swagbucks app and you can do this on your desktop or on your phone and I can be um, shopping in here. See the groceries, right? I can be shopping in here, buy my groceries and, um, and then earn back Swagbucks for this. And so this is incredible. So that's one way to earn money. Uh, to earn cash back, to, to save money on your groceries through Swagbucks. The other way is in store. So when you're going into the store, Swagbucks also have special things. So let's say, for example, this Ricola. Um, you can earn 100 Swagbucks if you buy this one. And then you would add that to your list of things that you want to buy. Now it's added. And then you can um, either have it, I think it's in your phone, or you can download it. Uh, sorry, I'm <laughs> losing my breath here. And you can see the different retailers. There are more there. There are all kinds of them. So it's really cool. And they also have special coupon page. So you can cut coupons if you want to. You can print them off or you just keep them on your phone and show them. And that works as well. I think, again, don't hold me to that. I haven't used the in-store one that much because I tend to do online here or through the other apps that I have. Honestly, I could be saving so much more of my groceries if I took these to the extreme, but I am so happy with just this, the little things I've already put in place have saved us hundreds of dollars. So I'm just so excited to share this with you. And then, so the way that the Swagbucks works, very similar again to the PC Optimum where 100 points is equal to $1. Um, and so on and uh so i you can also this one very much like the checkout 51 also has the ability to refer people so if after you use it and you realize how much money you've been earning back you can then let your friends and family know about it and if they use it then you can earn 10 percent on everything that they earn and you're not taking it away from your friends that they don't get, they don't have to pay you anything. The company Swagbucks pays you for this. So you're helping. It's like, it's like saying to your friend, we should go see this movie. And the friend goes and then the movie to the movie guy, when you buy your tickets goes, oh, by the way, here's five bucks for your time. Thanks for referring. And you're like, wow, sweet. We can get some popcorn now. So it's really cool. Um, and as you can see with the swag box, you can earn money watching videos, answering questions, uh, shopping at different stores, discovering things, all kinds of things that you can do. 
And currently you can see here, I've got 1600 swag bucks. So that's like $16 which is awesome. I like to, I like to play a game with this as well. And I don't like to ask for it too soon. I like to save it up. It's a little incentive. And when it reaches 50 or a hundred dollars, then I'll ask for a PayPal because you can get, you can redeem in different ways. Let's see here. Um, invite. No, I think you have to be on the, on the app to do the redeeming, which is fine. Oh no, there it is. Redeem. Sorry. I don't use the, the phone app very often. I do most of my swag backing on my computer because I just enjoy working with my computer better so you can redeem awards so here for example and they do sales look at this Amazon gift card a five dollar Amazon gift card but it only costs you three dollars seventy five right three hundred and seventy five swag bucks so you're getting more money than you got and then you have like it's incredible now personally I am not a huge fan of getting Amazon gift cards or other goodies like that because um the SO gift card would be good because you're you have to buy things like that. But like the Tim Hortons one here, like I could just make my own coffee. You're not saving grocery money by using that. But I like to use, let's see if I can find it over here. Um, let's see, where are they? View all. Okay, the what I highly, highly, highly recommend, PayPal, there we are. That is my favorite one. So I make my money back for my groceries. I can save money on my groceries using the Swagbucks app by saving it up. And then I just get PayPal to pay me into my bank account. And then I can put that aside and save that up for a special occasion, like a holiday or a birthday. Or you get so used to saving money that I just put it in a special account and save it up and then reinvest it. You can invest it in something that's going to earn you money, like buying more stocks or building a business. Or There's so many ways you can earn money. So if you're saving money on things you buy anyway, you're getting thank you payments back for doing so. Make the most of it. Don't just save up for for silly little gifts. All right, now I want to show you one of my absolute favorite apps, which is PC Optimum. I'm not sure if it's in your area or not. If it is not, look up grocery rewards, cashback grocery rewards, and see what is available in your area. This is available, as far as I am aware, all across Canada, and I'm not sure if it's available in the States. I think it might be, but again, um, you'd have to research that. And let me know in the comments below if it is available in your area or not. And if you have another app that you use that saves you money on your groceries as well. So in this one, you can see at currently we've got $87 worth of, or 87,000 points, which equals $87 of groceries. And the thing I love about this app is that it's connected to um, a grocery store chain and a drugstore chain and a gas station store chain. So we earn cash back. We earn free groceries rather because it's not cash back. It's groceries that you earn. It's money towards your groceries. And we earn that in our drugstore, our gas station and at our grocery store. And we can redeem them in the drugstore or at the grocery store. I'm not sure if we can redeem it at the gas station yet, but I don't care because we clearly tank up our cars with gas. So I love the fact that we're earning money towards our, our groceries by doing so. All right. So you can see here, they've got different, um, specials here. So the thing that is really cool about this app is it actually follows what you normally buy. So we buy a lot of no name products cause I really can't be bothered spending a lot of money just for a brand name when the new name is just as good. So that's just a personal, moral, ethical, probably a bit of my Dutch history of being thrifty and economic. But we buy a lot of no name. We buy a lot of um, fr fresh vegetables. And so those are the, are the offers that come up for us, which is amazing because then we are getting offers on products that we already use anyway, which I love. I'm not being bombarded with commercial advertising for something I'm not interested in or that something's trying to make me buy money or, or sorry, buy money would be great. Spend money to save money because there is no, that, that does not work. You do not save money by spending money. Do not believe that. You save money if those are products you buy normally anyway then you save money. So that's how that works. So for example, these oranges. Now, if I normally buy 
oranges every week and it comes on on my offer and I know that the oranges will last me two weeks I will buy two weeks worth of oranges so that I can in this case earn 200 points which turns around to about 20 cents for every dollar that I spent that's 20% savings um, that then adds up and I get to use towards my groceries you can redeem after $20 and you can redeem any amount that rounds off to a $10. So once I save up $20, I can redeem $20, I can redeem 30, 40, 50, and so on, which is amazing. And um, it also gives you extra bonuses. So down here at the bottom, so the top is really based on what I normally buy anyway. At the bottom, it takes what I normally buy and it says, wow, she really buys a lot of frozen vegetables because we do a lot of smoothies. So I'm going to offer her some frozen vegetables that might be of interest to her. So you can see here, a thousand points for this frozen spiral veggie zucchini thing. Now I'm not gonna buy it because it doesn't happen to be what I'm interested in, but Although, having said that, I might just throw that in my smoothie. <laughs> See how it's it's made me think, hmm, it is something that I put in my smoothie as a regular thing. So if it's a different version and I'm going to save money on it instead of buying my original, that's okay too. So it offers me things like this one down here, the 3,000 points, which would equal to $3 off on the garlic and herb seasoned bake tray. That is not something we would buy. So they will notice that and then they won't offer it when I don't use it. But I love that. So they give you incentives to try something new that is relatable to what you normally buy. So the spiral veggie zucchini thing, I just realized that it's not, I was thinking it was like spiral macaroni with vegetables in it. It's actually just the vegetable, which we buy anyway for our smoothies. So I might actually take them up on that one. But that's how this one works. Okay, so let me show you. The other cool thing is it shows the flyers right in the app. So you can see the store flyer and the drugstore flyer, not the gas station flyer because, well, gas stations don't tend to have a flyer. You can also scan your your optimum card right from your phone at the checkout. So if you don't have the physical card with you, you can just open up this app and if you turn it sideways, I'm turning it sideways, which you can't see, but that's how it would come up so that you can scan it really easily in store. And then you can see here in the points, it tells you what your points are at. It shows you your recent transactions. You can see groceries, the shop, the drug mart, and the gas station. Plus on the bottom, if you can link it to your PC Financial MasterCard, which I don't have linked currently, um, but you could add that and then earn extra bo uh, you know, bonuses towards your groceries from there. I love it. And then in the transactions, you can actually see, you know, your groceries, your uh, drugstore, your mobile, if you had a PC Financial, stuff like that. And that is really cool. And the other thing is, if you have, um, so in the account setting here, you can manage your cards. You can link more people to your cards so the whole family can be earning. So in our household, we've got myself and my, and my wife. And you can also start a points inquiry. So, you know, technology doesn't always work. And sometimes your points don't go through. They are so good at figuring that out. Look in here. I was shocked the other day when I saw this card was not swiped. What if you forgot to swipe your card? How cool is that? You could upload your receipt, um, write down the transaction number that they'll walk you through how to do it. How cool is that? You can actually earn money even if you forget. Like this is amazing. You're absolutely going to love this. So I highly recommend this one for sure. Um, yeah, so I, I just really wanted to show you uh, the PC Optimum because it is amazing and it has saved us literally hundreds of dollars worth of groceries. Again, you don't get cash back, but it saves up and you use it as cash in the grocery store. That's how this one works. The other apps actually send you the money either through PayPal or through a check. This one, it just saves it up and it becomes your your grocery cart, so to speak. It's great. And you can even, sometimes we just save up our points, like Christmas is coming up, so we're not using our points. We're just saving it up and then we can have something extra for Christmas, that kind of thing. All right. Now I want to show you Checkout 51. You're going to love this. So this is an app that actually gives you cash back on regular products. You can see there's all kinds of brand names. It is a very long list, so it does take a few seconds to go through. It just double check. What I tend to do is I'll do my grocery shopping because I don't like advertisers to determine what I buy. Instead, I buy what I buy. I come home. I show the receipt to this app. 
after I scroll through quickly and see if there is anything on here that I have purchased. If I bought um, this coconut oil, for example, which gives $3 cash back, that's pretty sweet. I'm glad I saw that. So you would add that. You can add as many as you like up to, and then it will see how it stops. It won't let you go further. So it will tell you how many you can add. So after you've added however many products it was that you bought, and you can always have a look at this before you make your grocery shopping list. Just be very careful that you don't buy things because they're on sale. You buy things that you normally buy, and if they're on sale, that is a bonus. And if they're on sale, and it's something that you buy normally anyway, then go ahead and stock up on them if that is financially viable for you, because that will save you over the long haul, which is fine. But again, I just want to warn you, they have a lot of stuff here. Don't just buy things just because. When you scroll down to the bottom, have a look at this. They have some extra things that they do as well. You can actually earn cash back by watching these video ads. You can see I've claimed one of them there. Here's another one that would give me three cents back just for taking like a second or two or 30 seconds max watching these video ads and you'll get cash back on those, which is great. Plus, as you can see at the bottom here, Every time you upload a receipt, you can add yourself to be included in a draw to win. And this time it's for $500 cash back, which is awesome. So that's how this works. So after you've decided what your what is on your shopping list and you've selected them in the app, then you go to redeem. Oh, here. Sorry, I clicked the watch video by accident. We'll go back. So then you go to redeem and what it's going to do. So you've clicked your things. You continue. Oh, it didn't. Um, let's see here. I'll do this one. Oh, it's asking for a scan. So in this case, I'd have to scan the unit. So there's my hand. <laughs> and uh, we're just going to get out of there. Okay. All right. Oops. <laughs> All right. So let's choose. Let's see here. This one. And we're going to continue. And then see how it wants you to line up the edges of your receipt. So that's it. You got it. So we press OK. Let's go. And then I would put my receipt here and I would scan it. And then as you're scanning it, it can only scan a bit at a time, right? So you'd take a photo and then you would say add a section. You'd add the next photo and then you would say finish. And then in this case, it's clearly not going to work because I didn't put one in. So it'll show me that it didn't work, which is fine. Um, so just give it a few seconds there. I probably totally confused the poor app, <laughs> but it works so well. We have earned, I think, $80 so far with this app. I'll show you in a moment. And we've only just been using it for a bit. Oh, way to save. Oh, apparently I saved $1. Not sure how that happened. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right. So you can also earn money with this app, which I love. When you, re if you watched a movie that you really loved, and you told your friends about it and they went to see the movie, the movie would earn more money. You would earn nothing. You just enjoyed the movie and you shared it. What if when you loved a movie and you sent your friends there, you earned money back for it? How cool would that be? You would still recommend only the things you like because, well, your reputation is on the line and people would only listen to you if you recommend things that are awesome. So, but yeah, they offer $10 cash back. For every friend that you refer which is awesome so that's my link I'll put it in the description below for you and you can see let me see here my profile see here we've earned $85 um, currently so currently we've got $85 sitting in there after you reach $20 you can ask for a check to be sent to you in the mail and uh, we just like to make a little game of it so my wife and I we always wait till it's a hundred dollars and then we redeem it which is cool and uh, yeah so that's how that works. All right, let's get out of there. And now let me show you. So we'll go into our flash foods. All right, so in flash foods, it's really cool because it actually shows you all the different um, stores where you can get the groceries marked off like crazy cheap. So let's go into the one that's close to us, Axbridge. And as we're scrolling down here, we can see that they've got some amazing deals. Like, look at this. And normally it's $6.49 for $1.75. So you can choose however many you want up to a certain limit. And they'll let you know each item has a different limit. 
and we can scroll down and see watermelon um, normally $8.99 for $2.50 um, yeah just incredible last minute deals and I like to use this for like meats and such and then I'll just pop them in the freezer look $18.98 down to nine something so you see how many okay it allows you to have one all right so that shows you the different things every day it'll be different um, whatever the store needs to get rid of before the expiry date and that's why they do this or that they just have too many of so it is fabulous because like yogurt and milk and um, the meats and everything I can just pop in the freezer so I am loving this we've only been using this for like two weeks and um, here you can see the savings look saved $118 in like two weeks that's just insanely crazy it's awesome absolutely awesome so totally loving this app highly recommend it for sure and you can see pickups would be there savings again there yeah just absolutely incredible and another one that I really love is receipt hog we're actually still fairly new to this one as well um, but it's really cool because you can upload a ton of different receipts from different kind of stores and it just slowly over time adds coins to your collection so to speak and then you can redeem them and you have a chance to earn pulls on the slot machine and if you do that you can earn chances earn spins by doing these things and let's have a look here at rewards you can redeem rewards and I like this because you can have PayPal as an option so you can see I'm at currently at 663 coins get to a thousand coins that's five dollars back for simply uploading a receipt that takes all of a few seconds, which is amazing. So yeah, totally loving this. Again, just another one. You can see the different receipts we've added in here. And uh, yeah, definitely recommend this one too. All right, so those are my five favorite apps. They're absolutely incredible. I'm so glad I got a chance to share them with you. All right, I hope you are just as excited as I am to save money on your groceries every single month. This is incredible. We're gonna spend money on our groceries anyway, so we may as well be rewarded for them, right? Okay, so have a look in the description below. I've got a link for you where you can download the PDF that I put together for you that has a list of all of the different apps, so you can just click straight to the apps and have a look at them yourself. I Honestly, I'm so excited to share these with you, so go ahead and get that. Here's a quick look at the inside, so you can see here's the PDF. And as you scroll down, I'll tell you a little bit about my personal story and how it worked. And then here we are. Here are the apps. So, and the links go straight to them and how it worked. And I've got some extra goodies at the bottom there for you, so make sure you go and check that out. And I will see you again soon. So, before you head off, if you found this helpful, will you give me a thumbs up? If you found it not helpful, will you give me a thumbs down? All right, because then I know what kind of videos to make for you, and I really appreciate helping you the best way that I can. So after you've done that, then go ahead and check out this video for 15 things that rich people do that poor people don't that could make a huge difference in your life too. All right, thanks. See you soon.